Hi there, I'm Sally. I'm Rocky's wife, and I'm going to show you how to make this card. It is, um, it's not that difficult. If you've never stamped before or, um, you know, glued items, I'm sure all of you have glued something at one time in your life. So what you can do is we're going to have these little card kits here. So each baggie is going to have everything that you need. So take everything out. You can just move it aside. So first we're going to start with this red piece of paper here. We're going to take this double-sided tape. Now this is extremely sticky tape. I like it because your cards are not going to fall apart. So you're going to take it like this, put your on the edge, and just run it down the side. Now the fact that it is so sticky, once it's down, it's down. You're not going to be able to pick it up and reposition it. So I like to do it part way, and I like to get the other piece up at the corner. And then put a little bit of pressure, and then move it over, get your scissors, and cut that off. Now, if you want to tear this, this tape is, you can tear it if you want to. So if you want to go like this and tear it, we'll see. Yeah, it does tear, but uh, whichever way you want to go. Just like that, take it and tear it, okay? So we're going to put tape on the red piece. We're also going to put tape on this piece too. You want to make sure you put the tape on the star side. So again, again, put it in the corner there, run it down the side. You go back, you can tear it. Then put it in the next corner. I find it easier, honestly, to cut it. And then, so that way I'm, I am right-handed, so I, I find it easier to place that corner, put my finger down, hold it tight, and then run it this way. So you can see, pull it back and tear that off again. And then just turn your paper a little bit, start in the corner, put a little bit of tape there, and turn it back. So you see how you want your tape to go to the corners, get back. That's all the tape you're gonna need. So now we're gonna go back to here. So here's your base, your card base. You wanna make sure your card opens from right to left, okay? So you wanna make sure you have your opening on the right-hand side. This makes it easier in the long run. Now to take the tape off, you wanna burnish it. See how I'm burnishing it with my fingernail? Burnish it, then take this finger behind you, bend your card just slightly, and then peel that up. Go to the next one, and peel that up. Go to the next side. See how I'm burnishing it just a little bit? Put a little bit of pressure at my forefinger I'm, with my thumbs. I'm bending the card back just slightly. You don't want to bend too much because you don't want to put a crease in your card. Close it up. There we go. So now, remember, this is extremely sticky. Once you put it down, you can't take it back off. So I just kind of eyeball it. See, I have my fingers, my forefinger and thumbs together like this. And then I'm having my other fingers hold the card stock down, card, the card base down. And then I kind of just uh, get it down. And sometimes it gets on straight, sometimes it doesn't, but it's okay. These are handmade cards. That's what makes them wonderful. Now we're going to do the same thing on this one. You're going to burnish it a little bit and then put your forefinger behind there, your thumb bending the card back, and peel that tape off. There you go. See? It just gets easier as you go along. Now remember that one piece... You can kind of go over the edge a little bit so you want to pull that over. Okay, so now this piece, you do not want to go in the center, but just go up just a little bit. So we're going to go up about, oh, about right there. I'll put it down. Okay, so now that's the top. Remember, we have the card opening this way. Now we're going to put that aside. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to take the blue ink, and it's called Denim Days, and we're going to take this little sponge. We're going to pinch it like this, and we're going to take this uh, piece of paper here. We're going to put some ink on there, and what you're going to do is just ink around here. Now, what I have is I have this figure behind here to give this paper some support. But you want to keep your fingers out of the way. So, see, I'm holding it like that. So, therefore, I'm giving that piece of paper some support. I'm just getting ink all around it. Okay, so now... 
I want to get ink on this side. So I'm going to be very careful. You want to hold it like this because you don't want to get ink on your hands. This ink is fantastic ink. It's kind of a cross between a water color ink and a, a permanent ink, a pigment ink is what we call it. So what that means is it does take longer to dry. So there we go. Okay. That's all the inking we're going to do with that. Alrighty. So next we're going to do is with this is we're going to use this wonderful gadget called a Misty. Oh, I wish I had invented this thing. So um, this has been well loved. <laughs> you're going to open that up. So you're going to take this piece of paper, the one you just inked up, and you want to line it up with the six. Yeah, as close as you can get. Just push it up against the side. This is the magnet. You put the little magnet right there on the edge. So now you're going to close the door, and you're going to look to see where your thank you is. And look at that. It looks perfect right there. Okay, so now we're going to open it up, and you're going to get the black ink, and we're going to just open this, and you're just going to tap ink on that side. You're going to close the door, put the ink pad down, and then you're going to push down with your fingers. And then you're going to open the door, and look at that. Voila! But it's kind of faint, so you want to ink it again. So make sure you're holding the ink pad around the edges there. Make sure you take things out of the way so you don't... Yeah, you don't want to put any pressure on this door, except just to the, the back there. There you go. Take this, push it down. Now it's getting darker. So I just want to make sure you can see what I'm doing here. You're going to take this again. And it's okay if you get ink all over the everywhere else on this door. It doesn't matter. But you want to make sure you just... You don't want to rub it. You want to tap it. Then I like to put the ink pad up above you so that way you know you're going to put your hands into it. And then you're going to close the door. Push down. You see, I'm just putting pressure on the words. Okay. And now we're going to open the door. And it's nice and dark. And you just stamped the words thank you. I'm going to move that aside. So now we're going to take this piece here again and we're going to take these little things called foam squares. So we're going to turn this over and you're going to add five of these to the back of this. So you can put one in that corner, one in this corner, one over there, one up here, and you want one in the middle. Now again, these are just as sticky as the double side tape, so where they go, it's where you're at, okay? So now you can take the little backs off of these. Just, just we'll have a little bin for trash there. <laughs> so again, you want to make sure that your card is opening this way. Believe me, I've done it plenty of times. I've done lots of things upside down. Because you don't want to put your thank you upside down. Turn around this way. And again, you just kind of want to eyeball it a little bit there. Just kind of line them up. And place it down. Put pressure where your foam squares are and that one in the middle. There you go. We're almost there. Now we're going to take the glue and there is um, ones on the stars. One side is nice and rounded over the sides and the other side's kind of sharp on the edges there. So the sharp edges is where you want to put the glue. Just that small amount in the center and just put the stars there. I like to do red, white, and blue. That uh, it doesn't really matter which way you do them. Again, you just want to make sure you feel that you feel the edges over on the side there. A little bit there. And then you want to get your little bow here and you want to kind of play around with it a little bit so they get all kind of wonky. Put your forefinger and thumb in the center, push down hard, and then pull these and straighten them out like that. There we go. And then we're going to put a little bit of glue there. And you want to place it across like that and put a little bit of pressure there. Now that glue will dry clear, so it'll be fine. So the last thing we want to do is open this up. And we're going to take this little stamp and we're going to ink this one up. Remember, you just want to tap your ink pads. So you want to make sure that you have this upside right, okay? So you're just going to take this, put it back behind you, and just one time just push down on it. And then relax and let it sit there for just for, oh, count to five. 
what you want to do is allow the um, paper to absorb the ink. And pick it up, and voila, there it is. And there is your card, all done. I'm sure I'm going to have a great time doing these, and the people receiving them are just going to really love it. Y'all have a great day.